Salam, I'm Sanjay. Salam, I'm Afsana. And today we are going to show you how to make a traditional Afghan kite. Let's see what kit we'll need. A ruler, four skewers, a pencil, glue stick or PVA glue, some tape, scissors, some string, strong polyester thread, tissue paper, at least 65 centimeters square to make the sail, and some lightweight polyester fabric or colored tissue paper for decorating. Step one, building the frame. For this, we need four bamboo skewers. These are about 30 centimeters long, which is short for your kites. You link them up with an overlap of five centimeter using any tape. What you get is a set of kite spars, a stretcher, which is 55 centimeters, and the spine, which you break 10 centimeter and is shorter than the stretcher. Step two, making the sail. We're gonna take our tissue paper, open it up and fold a diagonal. And then we're going to use our spine to make the correct measurement. The tissue paper should be slightly longer than the spine. And then we can cut. Step three, making the stretcher. Now that we have made the sail, we are going to use the spine to make sure it's the right size. Then we take our stretcher and some polyester thread to make the stretcher. So we take some thread and wrap it around one end of the stretcher. Wrap it around several times so to make sure it's not going to go anywhere and put two knots at the very end of it. What we do now is we're going to use the thread to pull the stretcher and make sure it fits within the sail we have made. Then we wrap it at this end, at the very end, a few times and put, break the thread and put a couple of knots. And now we have the sail, the spine, and the stretcher. If your stretcher is too big, what you could do is to wrap the thread around it so it will make it smaller as you can see. But ours were the right size. Step four, we're gonna take our glue and we'll start by gluing down the spine thoroughly. Now we'll glue both sides of the stretcher. As well as a third of each side of the tissue paper. and then we're gonna fold. Step five, 
Step five, decorating the kite. For this step, we need some tissue paper, ideally different colors, and we are going to cut them into different shapes and sizes. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna cut some squares then we are going to cut some hearts and we can also cut some circles Now we're going to get our kites and use some of the shapes to reinforce the frame. Now we can glue these down. And as we start to glue them down, we're just going to make sure that we're being gentle with the tissue paper so it doesn't break. Now we've turned the kite around, we're just going to glue down as many shapes as we like onto the front to decorate it. You can use whatever shapes and whatever decorations you like to make it personal to you. And then we're going to take our string. Make sure that we're cutting a piece that's longer than the wing span. And then we'll cut. Then we'll take another skewer and snap a piece off the end. Wrap the string around. Then we'll go to the top of the kite and pierce a hole. and sew through diagonally to secure it all together. Now we're gonna tie a knot. Now the spine and the stretcher should be secure once we've done that. Now we're gonna do the same for the other side. Now we're going to take the other end of the string, wrap it around the stick and pierce in the paper quarter of the way. So it's half. There we're going to. And now we're going to tie two knots to make it secure. Make sure it's tight and make sure that it's securing the spine. And now we are going to put a loop um, where, our, where we're going to attach our string. So the loop is slightly toward the headway. And this, as you can see, the loop is closer to the headway than the tail. And we are now going to attach the string 
to the loop and go fly our kite. The string runs through the loop, put two knots, and now we can go fly the kite. Great, now that we have made our kites. Yeah, shall we give these kites a fly? Let's go fly a kite. Yeah, come fly with us. Thank you.